Hello, I'm Robin Galeen, Mayor of Horsham Rural City Council. I'm here to report on the August 22 Council meeting. Council adopted the Horsham CAD Revitalisation Streetscape Plan. This is a high level strategic document that will guide the development of our CBD over the next 10 to 15 years. Of note, there are seven strategies and 15 achievable projects set out in this document. The purpose of this plan is to attract more visitors, help our residents spend longer in our city, shop, spend time with friends and support our fabulous traders. Some of the proposed projects include converting the Old Roberts Avenue kindergarten site into a contemporary children's space with play areas and change rooms for families. Another idea is a town square. Other ideas are more trees to make our city centre cooler and more attractive. Council has resolved to undertake further design work, stakeholder engagement, budget allocations and council resolutions before any of these projects proceed. Thank you to everyone who has contributed their feedback over the last two years into this project. We've taken on board your thoughts and ideas and suggestions and they've been incorporated and included in this plan. So thank you very much for taking the time to help improve and revitalise our beautiful city. Another item on the agenda was to update our governance rules. This was important because the capacity to live stream changes under the legislation as of the beginning of September. So these changes allow us to continue to live stream the council meetings to the community forever. The, one of the other changes was to change the language to be more gender neutral. Council is going to undertake a further review, a more extensive review of the governance rules within the next few months and they will come back to the to a council meeting and community consultation at some point in the future. There are two key events coming up on the council calendar. The first is a strategic planning expo at Heritage Hall at the Town Hall, Thursday the 1st of September from 6 till 8 p.m., Friday the 2nd of September from 10 till 7 p.m., and Saturday the 3rd of September from 10 till 1 p.m. I encourage you all to come along, have a look at all the projects that council is undertaking and provide your feedback. This is your opportunity to engage with council prior to the beginning of the council budget cycle. The second activity is the Spring into Horsham Festival that will be held from the Monday, the September 19 to Sunday, September 25. An ice skating room will be set up in Robert's Place where the Christmas tree was. Uh, tickets are available now on the council website. We've kept them very cheap, so $5 per child for a 45 minute session. Food, vans and live music will be supporting it. So it's going to be a really great activity for school holidays. So make sure you grab your tickets now so you don't miss out on enjoying this unique experience to come to Horsham.